Hello, hello. I'm on the final stretch of, of these puzzles. Still hoping. I think I've got about... What time is it now? Four o'clock. About six hours of solving. See how we get on. So, this one, so we've got numbered rooms, and then these are sort of Ursh wish. Oh, I should have Googled how to pronounce it. You know, they're all different um, uh, for each of the values, one to nine on the outside. Um, they always have to land on a line, which is interesting. I like that as a take. And then on each line, you've got to have the digit that counts the number of points that are hit on the line. Uh, does it matter at all if like both of those look at this? No, I don't think so by, by the rules. And then normal question mark stuff as well which a question mark on the outside is purely just the shading isn't it yeah but each of these clues must land on the line so that's got to be a nine and that's got to be shaded basically hasn't it two three four two three four two three four triple that's going to be seven or eight that's going to be a six or seven this could be a one two three five or six this could be a one, two, three, like that. Can't be two and three. And that's got to be an eight. As long as I'm understanding this right. But I think I am. Shade that, shade that, shade that, shade that. And then these are all shaded a bit like a party sort of thing. H is one. Then should we have a look at these ones? Two, three, four, seven, eight. That's got to be a seven. That's got to be a six or a seven. It's got to be a six. They're already shaded. That's fine. That's got to be a five. It's already shaded. That's fine. This be an eight or nine. It's got to be an eight. That's also shaded. Therefore, this one, two, three, or eight is a one, two, or three. That's okay. Uh, carry on around here. I think six, seven, eight, two, or three. Four, five, seven, eight, nine. This guy could be a two, seven, eight, or nine. This guy is a four or five. It's got to be a four. Each line contains a digit indicating how many shaded cells. Because I was just thinking about the fact that these either contain a two or a three, but and they obviously have to be different. The sort of the thing I was thinking about. Might come into play. We shall see. That's a one. So we've definitely got another shaded thing along here. And if that's, if that's, yeah, I want to finish this off. If that's three, it means this line doesn't contain the two and everything's shaded. If it's a two, it means that's shaded. So that's definitely always shaded. And it's always also hit by a clue because you're only shading. Shade each of these landing points. Ah, oh, but I oh know, but it can't be hit by that. And it can't be hit by that. So that is does that does have to be a two, I think. If I'm understanding that right. That's gonna be a one, two, or three, because you gotta have a number that represents how many times that's been shaded. And that's pointing to one of those, isn't it? Yeah. Cool. Um, can we say anything about any of these guys? Potentially, that's not four. And let's, I'm going to cross some stuff off if I've shaded. Ah, and like that can't be shaded, can it? Because, so that can't be a seven or else this would need a three. Yeah, so that has to be a nine. That's sort of acting as a two on the outside, but that doesn't particularly matter. So that's done. That guy is done. Because I sort of want to say, do I think that this is ever shaded and it's not? Do I think that this is ever shaded? It is not, because that would have to be a four. 
So this needs a one on it. This obviously needs a three on it. Can this cell ever be shaded? No, so this needs a two. That guy is marked, that guy is marked, that guy's not. This guy is marked. He's marked, he's marked, he's marked, he's marked. He's marked. I dare, I forgot to do these ones, didn't I? Two, three, six, seven, eight. That could sort of be however it wants. The shading along, ah oh no, because this guy looks up. He, he's going to shade one of those two. Can this cell ever be shaded? No. And they've both got to be shaded and they've both got the container too. Um, so something's got a point at that, which is going to be one of these, which implies neither of those are shaded. I really like this as a concept. Very cool idea. I thought there was something going on with threes. But maybe not actually. It's not one. So the only thing I've got left to shade is all of this jazz. This has got to look at that and then the other one will pick it up sort of thing, won't it? Yeah. Hmm. Oh, that's not one. Oh, I know that's two. That's not eight, four, or nine. Uh, wait, that's just three, five, six, or seven, isn't it? Oh, so it's not two. Look at that. Wow. Weird. Very weird. This cell. Five, four, three, seven. Not one or two. That's six, eight, or nine. Twos are here or here, but that seems okay. Hang on, my sister's just calling me out here. I'll pause the recording and come back. Alrighty, we're back. Been a and forty five minutes. So I'll have to get back into the puzzle. Um I should have done this before. It's n number dreams and then these are all different and then the whole shading thing, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So we should be fine. Relatively straightforward, or is that so? I need to. I'm wondering about. Oh, and the other thing, of course, is is these all looking at different things that I need to be aware about? So, things like. Wondering if there's any digits that are hard to place up here. The only thing I haven't got in pencil marks so far is a four. And um where am I going with that? I wonder. No, I'm not sure. Um and the four obviously can't be marked by a four, and it can't be marked by a two or a three either, looking at what's on here. <coughs> oh, sorry. Um, oh, I had some <laughs> wall that went right down the wrong way. Uh, so fours, fours will definitely be either F or G, which implies that four is either here or here on this line. Annoyingly, both of which work absolutely fine. So that's not as useful at all. Just want to mark that those two are the same. Is there anything else like that? The trouble is threes. Well, threes. I know, but threes could go here, couldn't they? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, because yeah. I was thinking about the fours only uh, sort of stopped going on here, but that's only relevant for those fours. So, these two cells being the same, is that interesting at all? If that's three, it's highlighting both of those. If it's four, it's highlighting both of those. Uh, not that useful, actually, I don't think. And I know one of these two is highlighted from the twos. 
because of course all this is the number of highlighted cells on here is all different i don't think this could ever be a one i want to say if this is ever one then that would be two and that would be three and this would be highlighted Oh, that does work with a seven there. So they'd all sort of have to look at that one line. The other thing that's potentially interesting is that from B, C, and D, from this two, three, four, you'll get one highlighted on each of these. You've got the option of getting an extra highlighted one from this cell, from one of those two, and from this cell. So that's at most six on here. Annoyingly, that means that, that this cell could be the one, two, three that um, highlights it. And, and you really don't need that much is highlighting. But if, if this cell isn't one, yeah, here's something maybe. If this cell isn't one, you do need six distinct things that are on all this that cell would be highlighted because that would be the four and this would take one thing that would therefore be seven or eight making a seven eight pair does that help at all that's highlighted that's also highlighted that would have to be highlighted yeah, so if that's not one, I know all of these three are highlighted. That would be four, that would be four. One of these would be looking at this seven. And the one that's a three. Yes, this is a problem, isn't it? Because... So if that's a two three pair, I think this is I think this is generally going to help. Oh well, no, it's going to be massive. Uh, I think. <laughs> so if this is a two three pair, that's four, and that cell is highlighted. These nine now need the things that can point to them, which are these, to all be different. The problem with that is so that will be highlighted. That will be highlighted. That will be highlighted from here. One of these would have to be a seven looking at this thing. But you'd end up with a two, three pair like that. So you're either like this or you're like that. Oh, no, it does work. The one with the seven then looks across. The one with the that being a seven would be a three here. So that is fine. Ha. Huh. That would have to be seven, that would be eight. That would be two. No, that would be eight. Why have I got twos pencil marked? I think that's just normal twos, isn't it? Yeah. That would be eight. These would be a two. This can't I don't know, can't be two anyway. Um that would be highlighted from there. So then this would be the three, and that would have to be three. That would be seven. So if this is a two, three pair, this one is three. If this is a two, three pair, this one's three, that's two, that would be two. I think that's all okay. Three, seven, eight, seven. Don't think I see any problems with that at all. Hmm. So maybe can I just prove this being a one? If this cell is a one, it would mean that that cell has to be highlighted. I suppose. Yeah, I know. I know that's always highlighted, but I don't think that's that useful. If this is a one. 
because you'd be picking up a two from there. That cell would be highlighted with a three and a two, both looking at that one. That would be highlighted from the four. That would be highlighted from the three. So then you'd need another highlighted thing in here, which would only ever come from that being a seven. That couldn't be an eight. It could be a six or a seven. But I think in either case that's... No, because in the case that that was a two, three pair. In the case, that, in the case that this is a two, three pair, you get that shaded from this. You get that shaded, you get this shaded, that would be seven, eight. That's therefore looking at that, therefore that's the three, that's the three. So that's number two. And if that is one, then that's cell shaded. If that's three, everything's shaded. If that's three, that's three, that's shaded. So then this would have to be a seven. I think this breaks, doesn't it? One. Hang on, one, if that's three, that's one, that's three, that would have to be seven. And then the case where this is a two, three pair, two, three, that had to be three, that had to be seven to pick up that, didn't it? So that's always a three, seven. I'm pretty sure. But annoyingly, both of these things seem to work. If this is one, is this cell ever three? I don't think so. If this is one that's shaded from those two, so then that looks at this, that looks at that, that cell shaded. No, this is always a two. And isn't it always shaded? Because in the case where that's a one, you get a three, two, four, three, that's then shaded. If it's a two, then it's shaded. So that's always shaded. This now can't be a four. It can't be a three because of that. Right, there we go. That's a four. That cell shaded. This is now a three. Three, seven. They're not sevens. Um, This cell shaded from that stuff. So that's pointing at that. This is pointing at that. This has got to be a seven, eight here. That one shaded. That one shaded. That's got to be shaded. Uh, that's looking at this guy, so that he needs to be a 2-3 with that shaded. That's not shaded. This has got to be a 1 with both of those being pink. Uh, no, no, sorry. That's a blue. And they're 1s. Interesting. Tricky. But very interesting. There's a 2 there. I've said that needs a 4 on it, and it also needs a 3 on it. Look at that. Kind of crazy. Very good. This is five, six, eight. This is five, six, seven, and eight. This is that cell, which can't be a one, of course. Uh, something like that. Oh, this is a three, four pair now, of course. Lovely. Where's seven? Sevens are here. Very good. So, um, along here now, maybe? Four, one, almost. Six. No, one of these has to be one. One of these has to be one. So what's done? Let's get rid of my yellow, because that's not very useful. This guy is a five, six, eight, or nine. He's marked. Actually, I think I was crossing off things that are shaded, but I've done I've done literally all my shading now. So let's get rid of all of these. And I've got yeah, on every question mark, that's all fine. Good. So now I think the only thing left to do is all this stuff. On five, eight, and nine. 
thought that wasn't going to give me anything then. Cruel. And now I need a one here. Now I need a one there. And that is a strict three, four pair. Which can go either way around. It just changes which way around is F and G. F and G. There's a three, of course. I was looking at that and thinking, I'm sure I've done done enough there. Uh, I've done the wrong thing, haven't I? One, two, five, six. If two is definitely here, one's not there, of course. That cell's not one. Look at this. So therefore, that's a one and that's a one. And now this line is happy. Happy, happy, having fun, fun, fun. Um, mistakes, ones and twos. There's a one up there. So I know that these, I should, I should use, uh, should I use colors? Because I've done, I've done all my shading now, haven't I? I don't really, but I don't really want to lose my shading either. I'll leave it, leave it for now. See what happens. But what I would like to do is identify those four cells, which I know form a quad. And therefore, if there's anything that all four of them look at, that might be of relevance. Or it should be of relevance, shouldn't it? It's like this cell can't be a nine, but that's from those two being a nine. Let's put in what this can be. It is kind of restricted. Sixes. Hmm. Um. It's close to doing something, isn't it? If that's eight, yeah, eight's there. That seems okay. Yeah, because literally all this is saying now is that those four are all different. I think. These two are different, so they both see that. Same thing here. Oh, hang on. There's a three, four, uh, no, five. Four, five, eight, nine, seven. There we go. So that's four and three like that. It's counting on my hands up to that to get the threes now look are here. It's a six, seven, well, it's a six, nine pair. Nice. Uh, last seven, last seven. One, two, five, seven, eight, threes, fours, and then nothing else. Six is not here. So, if this is six, it puts a six there, puts the six there, 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 here, there, and here. That all seems okay. About if this cell is six, there's a four. Is that all my fours? It's got to be most of them, isn't it? I think there's enough for that not to actually help. Or twos. Also not enough for that to help either. Um, there's a number that's here that's a one. <laughs> so ones, ones, ones. Which I knew already. Three, four, six, seven, one. Twos are there. Seven. Eights are here. So... 
I mean, that cell has either got to go here or there. If if it was these two. It sort of goes around the grid like that, then can go wherever it wants over here. Am I missing something obvious? A naked single or something. One of these two is a nine, so nines aren't there. That is not a very clean set of pencil marks really is it so if that's nine that's nine 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 thing is with the stuff i'm looking at nine nine there of course is nine nine six uh, sorry, nine, nine. What did I do? I think it was nine here. Nine here, nine here, nine, six here. Nine there. Nine, four, five per six, eight. So if, if these, if that sells nine, this sells five. That's an eight and that's a six. So this isn't, that's either six or nine. Because if nine, nine, six, oh no, sorry, nine puts four, five puts, or nine puts eight, puts six, puts five. And put six and puts eight and put six yeah six nine pair that's created i think that's a very useful thing at all there i could say that those two are the same does that help at all what happens if this is eight if this is eight, we get an eight there. We get a six, five, six, nine, five here. Nine, six, nine. No, I'm thinking about if this is eight. Eight, eight. One, eight pair. Nine, six, five, six. Five eight there. Five eight. These selected cells will be eight. That would be nine six nine six. We have six here. So wait, sorry, six. Nine. Now if that's six, that's six. That that's nine, that's That's not six. <laughs> that was what I was saying. If that's six, that's nine, that's six. Then one of these two has to be six, exactly one. And it can't be this one, it's got to be that. And that breaks. Okay, okay, that breaks. If this is six, that is six. Then sixes are here, but obviously can't go there because... We're seeing the other one, so it has to be six there, but that puts six there. So that's not six. And now this is this way around. Nine, six there. That's five, five, six, nine, eight. Eight, six, five. Four, nine. I've got two fives. No, how have I got two fives? Okay, that six was right. I just rush some stuff. Sixes are there. This has to be five and six. No, now I've got two sixes. 
think I've messed up my pencil mark somewhere. Is that a nine? That's a nine. That's got to be a five eight. That's got to be a six. That's got to be a five. That's looking at this, Joe, and... Ah, oh, bugger. Ha. <laughs> uh, uh. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, sorry. I don't think I've had a very good hit rate of... Um, puzzles that I've actually managed to do correct pencil marking on like the whole solve eight's not there that's not four or five that's not four it's not six okay but I think I should be able to hopefully that's not a th Seven's got to go here, don't they? And then that was a naked single, I think. Or like restricted. So that's then three, four. Uh, what else did that do? One, two, four, five, eight, seven, three, six, nine pair. Seven, of course, three, seven. Okay, I think I'm more or less back to where I was. So, if this cell isn't nine, that cell's nine, that's nine, that's... Oh, now everything's thrown out of whack because of this, I think. Oh, uh, no. One, two, four, five, seven, eight. Threes are placed. One, two, three, eight, five, seven. So, if this cell is nine, then that's nine, it's nine, six and nine, nines will go down here, but that's okay. I don't think that's following on nearly as much as it was before. Twos are somewhere here and fours are somewhere here as well, aren't they? Ones are there. If this is, say, this was eight. Your eight's looking like that. You. Eight, nine here. Eight's here. Five, nine pair. What if... Five, six, look. But seven's there. Which I knew. Yeah. So this can't be five or six now, because that sort of feeds through there, doesn't it? So if this was eight, that would also be eight. Cool. Right, nine, six, nine, six. Six is here. One of these two is six. That both sees that. Six, eight, nine, four, six, five, eight, six, five. Five, nine, eight, three, four, six. Much better. Sorry about all that. Eights are up here. Uh, fours, one, six, and one. Eight, nine, eight and five, five, not a five, two, four, six, one, eight. Four's up there. Ones are here. Two, five, four, eight, nine, five, two, six. Uh, one. 
nines, fours, fours, uh, threes, nines. Eight, four, four, two, two, five. There it is. Right. Oh, that was silly, marking that cell rather than that one, wasn't it? Easy mistake, at least. But yeah, very cool puzzle. Enjoyed that. Intensely. Thank you for space and the notation and such. Nice ideas. Good flow. Yeah. Well, thank you for the puzzle. Thanks for watching. Chat to you all sometime later.